Please confirm your name and tell the church what the Lord did for you. Praise the Lord. Church, praise the Lord. My name is Sister Elizabeth. Church, it they walk. It they walk. I want to thank God because hey, the power that is in this place is too much. During the minister's uh, fire conference, I, I, I went to, somebody called me to come to Suleja and do something for her. So on my way going, I entered the keke. We were six in the keke. So the keke man told us that he wants to follow a shortcut. I told him that we were telling him that no, let's just follow the trail. He said, no, that road is fast and uh, close. I said, okay. So when we follow the road, <laughs> we reached one place, the keke man stopped, and behold, people started coming out from the bush. Other men came and joined him around that Suleja area. And behold, they marched us to the bush, and we entered the bush, and they came and brought us to a shrine. And they told the Baba that was there that they had brought us, that this is the people they brought for the sacrifice. Immediately I heard that. I didn't even wait for Baba to start talking. I told Baba that me, I cannot die. That... Daddy has given a decree that where blood is wanted, mine cannot be shed. So I cannot die. It is not possible. So they say, they say I should shut up. Those people around say I should shut up. I say I cannot shut up because I come from Donamis and Donamis represent power. So it is not possible for me to die. I cannot die. <laughs> They want to start with me. I say, okay. I was there. The man carried collapse. He raised it up and his hand yes. remained there. <laughs> hey! He said, okay, since the uh, collapse will not work, he now picked the gun. But I don't know where he picked the gun. Me, myself, I was scared, though. The man shot at me. <laughs> I was scared. But he shot at me twice and nothing happened. <laughs> they used to use. He raised that one up. His hand hooked there for like five minutes. He fell to the ground. Then he now got the people that, uh, that brought the uh, people and, and carried them to one corner and was telling them, I don't understand what is happening. Oh. So at that moment, the people that were there, I said, oh, we should start running. So we're running. We started running. All of a sudden, I said, what am I even running? What is pushing me? In short, I will not run again. So I was walking. I was just walking. And when they discovered that we were gone, they started looking for us. The amazing thing is that they passed me. They were looking for us, but they passed me and they did not see me. Hey! <laughs> so that's how we were released and we came to the road and I come to return all the glory to God of this commission because it's by his doing. If not for him, I don't know where I would have been. For her sake, everybody with her was saved. Paul the Apostle God said, There shall be no loss of any man's life. And have given you all that sail with you. All that travel with you are given to you for your sake. You see, whenever your destiny is being decided, never hold your peace. Never keep quiet. Irrespective of the devil that is involved. She said, uh, they said that this is the sacrifice we brought. He said before the Baba, the demon agent could speak. She started talking first. She said, no way. I am not a blood that can be shed. My pastor said, where blood is wasted, mine cannot be wasted. You cannot kill me. I am from Dunamis. And Dunamis represents power. was a woman like a man 
That was a lioness. The daughter of a lion is a lioness. And the man carried his cutlass and his hands suspended. When was the last time you heard that? In the Bible. Well, King Jeroboam wanted to slap the man of God from Judah. And he did like this and his hand remained in the air. Pulled it down, no way. That is Bible days are here. The things that we saw in scripture, they are here. He carried the gun. Gun could not work. Shot twice. Release her and they were passing her without seeing her. Beloved brothers and sisters, the reason why you hear these things is so that you can have faith and audacity in similar situations. In case the devil ever bring you into face to face with such situations, you will understand that if God has done it before, he can do it again. If he has done it for one, he can do it for another. And to remember that you cannot die like chicken. You are not permitted to die like chicken. No man, no woman, no devil agent who has his own life in his system has the power to take your own life nobody with blood in his blood vessels has the right to dry up your own if they want blood let them drink their own blood if they want death let them take their own life hey. right now I decree with authority and audacity against that particular covenant against that particular ritualist that ritualist team and group starting from the tricycle rider and the, and the accomplices and the, and, the, and the high priest of that ritualist altar I declare their death is confirmed the same power that suspended his hand that same power led them to rest now and every other terror cell and kidnapper cell ritually cell within the city and environment we declare their end has come Amen. they shall die like chicken Amen. as they want life their life shall go give the Lord a big clap of hands come here and let me pray for you and lift up your hands you represented God well and you represented church well and the Lord perfect other things that concern you more fire more fire more fire give the Lord a big clap as you take your seat still praying we declare that every weapon they have fashioned against you is hereby cancelled in the name of Jesus we declare that every shame every ignominy every reproach that they plotted against you today that shame that reproach is arrested and fired back to where it came from in the name of Jesus Christ we declare that you shall not be reproached we declare you shall not see shame we declare you shall fulfill your days in the name of Jesus and today we set every witchcraft coven on fire the witchcraft coven fighting your life fighting your destiny manipulating your life we set it on fire is hereby set on fire in the name of Jesus and God will open your eyes to identify them God will cause you to know them as they confess and they are laid to rest if you believe it shout aloud Amen please take your seat